Uh, all right and welcome. I just want to make this quick video about uh, painting in Blender <clears throat> and it uh, kind of touches up on 2.8 also. So first off, uh, uh, I have here a quite low poly mesh which only have like a normal map and a diffuse map. And uh, what I notice is that um, Blender is kind of laggy when you're uh, 3D painting when it has two projects. Like here in 2D mode, there's no issue, it goes super smooth even at like 4K textures. But in the GD viewport, <coughs> I noticed that like uh, I have to paint on my low poly model instead of my high poly model uh, because it's so laggy. Um, and I'm gonna show you what I mean. So here I have. Uh, just like the standard hard brush from Blender. And as you can see, the strokes are really choppy. It's kind of so bad that it uh, interpolates like wrong, like how I draw this like as curved, uh, or like this as shaped. It's uh, lagging behind so much. And with like textures, it's kind of okay if you have a large texture. I have a spacing of, uh, I think, 10%. Okay, 16%, I can just put it on 10. So that's okay, but when you make it smaller, uh, it has to space more textures and uh, compared to if you have a large one, like I mean, then it goes okay. But if you make it really small, you kind of get this um, uh, laggy behavior once again, which uh, is kind of hard for you when you're going to make details. So let's jump into 2.8 and uh, actually I don't think they touched up on this uh, texture painting projection in 3D viewport at all in 2.8. I think we're just going to get this for free because it's um, basically much faster viewport. So you can see I have the same model here, the low poly model and if I go into texture paint mode, uh, the same hard brush and I paint, you can see it's much smoother even though it's kind of weird when it um, when it's uh, been drawn because it's uh, you, you get this like um, transparent, but anyways you don't get this super laggy behavior like in 2.79 so that's cool oh by it might be a bit laggy actually yeah, uh, I think the same goes for if you have like a texture, if it's large it's okay, but if it's smaller it's gonna start to lag, but um, it's not as bad as in uh, 2.79. Um, and hopefully this is something we could, can see getting touched up in the future, because uh, one th uh, one thing that is nice is the like 3D project projection painting, but I mean, uh, like in 2D projection, it's very smooth. There's no no problem since you you're not 3D projecting. Um, so in worst case, uh, I'm painting like in 2D and then checking the 3D model all the time, or I paint the details in the in the 3D model like this and. Uh, then I go back to uh, to the uh, to the to the painting mode and paint. But um, it would be cool if we could get something like this. This is from Armory, which is a 3D engine uh, heavily integrated into Blender, and they're using the GPU. And I've seen this before, also like uh, these web-based uh, painters that are using WebGL and making everything on the GPU. GPU. So this is like 4K which is impressive and uh, there seems to be no lag at all and uh, this time in Blender I don't see like since we have cycle and a lot of other stuff is like heavily based on the GPU and hopefully we're gonna get more stuff on the GPU like particles and stuff like that at least simple particles maybe not hair particles uh, could be GPU based and super fast and uh, I think it's time for Blender to start exploring if we can have uh, uh, like GPU based painting because of course you're gonna have an issue with um, VRAM uh, since most of us have more like regular RAM than video RAM on the graphics card 
But the performance is like uh, it's miles ahead of uh, trying to um, projection paint in 3D with uh, just using CPU power. So it's kind of clear that the EPU is the way of the future for painting. So hopefully we can have something like that in Blender and um, these days could be long gone. Uh, yeah, that's all the video I just wanted to show you. Uh, I kind of really like Blender 2.8 more and more. <laughs> You're getting to the point where you wish um, uh, you could do more work with it. But um, I've seen on the on the podcast they're talking about adding the modifiers and stuff like that. So that's going to be really nice. And when that happens, I'm going to try to uh, load all my like brush settings and uh, add-ons and stuff like that into 2.8. Even if it's super, super early, I think it's still... Uh, the viewport is uh, way worth it. EV, the EV viewport. Uh, yeah, so yeah, that's the only thing I wanted to show you. Painting in Blender is kind of a hassle and uh, the future is GPU based. Uh, but uh, hopefully this guy, I saw him talk at um, uh, Hacks at a conference in Amsterdam recently. So I checked out his video, it was really cool. Uh, you can try and uh, Google that one up. Uh, armory seems kind of nice, but um, yeah, maybe someday I have the time to check it out. But until then, bye!